Hello everyone, today's video is exercise and working on our glutes. We're going to be working other parts of our bodies, of our body, however our main focus is our glutes. Exercise, you're going to need a kettlebell or um, a hand weight or um, a water bottle if you don't have a kettlebell or um, a hand weight. And also a step stool or a chair to, for modification on squats. I don't put out on any music, so you can put on any type of music you like because I find people like all different types of music. So put on the, whatever music you like and just follow along. Um, I'll, we'll be stretching along with um, cardio, but because of the um, exercise regimen has a lot of movement in it. We won't need to do too much cardio because we will be moving to keep that heart rate going, to keep our blood flow warm and throughout our muscles and joints. So without further ado, let's get started. What we'll do is for a stretch. So we're going to stretch out our legs first. So you want to get to the wall if you can't keep your balance and you'll just, if you can keep your balance, you'll just hold on Straighten out your core, keep it straight, bring up your leg, grab your foot and go forward with it. And just stay focused. If you can't, you can just hold on to the wall. So we'll stretch for 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So you're bending forward, keeping everything straight, keeping your core engaged and your leg and bring it as close as possible to the other leg and you can feel the stretch. Go to the other side. Same thing, if you need to lean on the wall for balance, that's fine. You grab your foot, the top of your foot, and then you lean forward. And if you're able to hold on, you can just keep your arm out for balance or you can always hold on to that just for, um, for security and just lean forward and feel that stretch. Okay, we'll go to the mat and we'll do some side by sides and just stretch our legs more. So go to the one side, lean forward, go to the next. That's one, two, three, four, you can feel stretching here and in here, five, six, Call from. seven, eight, nine, ten. And then next we'll go ahead and stretch our arms. So we'll just bend down our hand and push and keep your shoulders back and just feel the stretch as you push down on your fingers. So one, two, three, four, five. Do the opposite way. One, two, three, four, five. Do the other hand. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. And we'll go to the arm, shoulder back. One, two, three, four, five. Below the elbow, make sure it's below the elbow. I'm pushing with my fingers below my elbow. One, two, three, four, five. And the other arm, shoulder back, press below the elbow. One, two, three, four, five. And over. One, two, three, four, five. Now we're going to start out with 10 jumper jacks to get our heart rate going. So you either can um, do modification by going one, one, or do a full one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, now for the first exercise, what we're going to do is squats. Um, if you're unable to follow along or you need some modification with squats, what you can do is get a, a chair or a stool and when you squat, you want to bend your legs 
bring your arms forward and suck in your abs and then you're going to go back on your heels like you're going to sit down and then what you do is sit down and then get back up by your heels and stay and then squat up um stretch up and tighten your glutes then go back down sit down and then come back up then here's another modification when doing squats if they go into kneeling position if you need you you can put down the pillow for more cushion and for it to um not give you had to go down as low as um possible so what you could do with this is go down and then when you go all the way down and you kneel you go down on the pillow and then come back up okay what we're going to do is go start going towards the right and then we'll move towards the left and we'll go ahead and squat down so you're going to keep your abs engaged and your legs bent and then step over squat down come back up squeeze your glutes go again go to the other side same thing and squeeze your glutes go back down go to the other side now we're going to do two we'll go one up squeeze squeeze go to the other side we'll do two over here so go all the way down up all the way down up go to the other side then we're going to go halfway go down halfway down again and then get up and um squeeze so we'll go down halfway down up squeeze go to the next side We'll go down, halfway, down, up, squeeze. Next one, we're gonna go down and on our knees. And then back up, up, squeeze. Go to the other side. Repeat it, go down, down on our knees, up, squeeze. Next side, we're gonna go down and pulse for five, ready? One, two, three, four, five. Up, squeeze. Then go to the other side. One, two, three, four, five. Up, squeeze. Okay, next we're gonna do um we can take a water break. So you get some water whenever you need it. And just keep moving. Then we're going to do um, kettlebell swings. So you can do the kettlebell, which you can always go. You go down in between your legs and then up. Don't go past your um, shoulders. Or you can use your hand weight and just hold it like that and go down. Or you can use the water bottle. Same thing, just hold it like that and go down and up. But don't go all the way up. Just keep it to the shoulder length. So, we'll squat down and come up. Squat down, come up. Squat down, straight. Four. Squeeze when you come up. Five. Six. Seven, and straighten your legs. Eight, nine, ten. Okay. Next, we're going to go um, do reverse lunges. It's great for your glutes and also your legs. Tighten your core to keep your balance. Lift your leg to go back and they go down. So you go one, two, up, stretch, and tighten. So you go back down, one, two, up. So again, if you need to, you just go to the wall and you just hold on. You go down, up, and always keep your um, core gauge. So that's three, and you just stretch and tighten. Four, 
five, six. It's easier doing it too, so you go seven, eight. And you want to bring your body down, not push forward. Nine, ten. Then we'll go to the other side and just keep your gate, um, core engaged. Bring your foot up, step it back, and then get the length that you want to be at. So if you need to get your balance, you get your balance. And keep your core. And then go down one. And tighten. So, so one, one. So one. One, two, two, three, three, four, four. Squeeze when you come up and bring your leg tight. Five, six, six, seven, seven, eight, eight, nine, nine, ten, ten. So we'll go ahead and stretch our legs after that. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Go to the other side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. The next one we'll go on the floor. This is more cushioning. So I'm going to bring this in. And we're going to do some bridges. So we'll go down on the floor. Bring your feet as close as possible to your glutes. And then you'll lay back. Then we'll go up and do 10. Push, keep your shoulder blades to the ground. And then push up, squeeze in, holding your abs in. And squeeze your glutes and legs. That's one. Go down on the flat back and up. That's two. Three. You want to push up by your heels. Four. Five. Six. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, next we'll go ahead in to one donkey kicks. So you get on your hands and knees, but before that we'll do some cat and cow. So what you'll do is go fly back with your head up and then curl your back up so you'll breathe in. Exhale, breathe in, exhale, breathe in, exhale, breathe in, exhale, step, step, Then we'll go ahead and go into um, a child's pose. So go ahead and um, spread your legs, bring your big toes together, and push down on the palm, palms of your um, hand, and put your head to the mat, and stretch. Push into the palms of your hands and push back. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten. Now we'll go ahead and do um, our donkey kick. So we'll go ahead and um, go up and bring it in. Up, bring it in. That's two, three, 
more. All right. Keep your core engaged, pushing up on the um, palms of your hands. Sex and crunching that as you bring your knee to your nose and your head. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Then we're going to keep it up and we're going to kick for ten. One, two, pulse. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We'll keep our leg up and then go up to the side. That's one. The fire hydrant. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. And we'll straighten out our leg, bring it over to the right, and then we'll go one, high over, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten. Then we'll bring it back out. Then we'll kick, come back in, down, up, side, kick, down, up, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten. Okay. Now we'll go to the other side. So we'll go ahead and go up, back in, crunch, pushing up on our palms, crunching in, core tight, back out. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine, ten. Then we'll pulse for ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Then we'll come back down and go with one fire hydrant. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ten. Then we'll go ahead and straighten out our leg, bring it to the side, and kick high to each side. One, two, three. Keep your core engaged. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten. Then you bring your leg back in. Then you bring it up like a fire hydrant. Kick it out. One, up, kick. Two, up, kick. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now we're going to go ahead and do cat and cow. So we'll do breathe in, breathe out. Breathe in, breathe out. Breathe in, breathe out. To um, child pose, toes, big toes together, stretch your legs, sit back on the heels, reach out your arms, pressing your palms, bring your forehead to the mat, and press and feel the stretch. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We'll come back up. And then what we're going to 
want to do is reach out. When you reach out, you want to reach to the um, opposite, both your, your fingers to the one side of the wall and your feet to the other, and stretch with tightening your glutes. So you just stretch for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Do the other side, hand out, leg back, reach to both sides of the wall. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Then we'll go ahead and get on our back. Bring our legs in, hug them, squeeze up for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Reach out your arms, bring down your head and shoulders, drop your legs, and look the opposite way for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Then we'll go back to center. Then to the opposite side and turn your head. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Back in. Reach arms overhead. Spread your legs out. Reach your toes to the one wall and your fingers to the other wall and stretch. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Then we'll go ahead and right, get up on our feet. Go to the wall and do our final stretches. So we'll grab our foot, front of the foot. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. To the other side. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Go back to our mat. Then we're going to stretch. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two. Three, four, five. One, two, 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 three, four, five. We'll go. We'll do our final breathing. So we'll go down, squat down. Come up, inhale, exhale, back up, breathe in all that self-love, exhale all the love to the universe. One, four, that's it. Well, I hope you enjoyed the exercise. Um, you can repeat this um, two to three times if you don't feel like you had enough. You can always pause it in between and work out on your own as well. Just keep on hit and go when you're ready. And if you like it, give it a big thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed as of yet, then please subscribe. And like always, have a happy, fun, safe, and blessed day. Stay healthy and fit. Make sure you check out my recipes.